Hey friends, welcome to Adam Style Library and today's review is about the Iron Studios Marvel Comics Art Scale 110 Deluxe Statue of Odin. Now, I've received this box uh, today. Uh, it was uh, in a shipper box, brown shipper box. I took it out and today I'm going to show you what's inside it, how to assemble it and uh, how it looks. So this is the package. This is the back of the package showing how the figure looks. Uh, it is mentioned as Iron Studios and its logo. Nothing in the back. In one side there is a spot for an ish, uh, picture in Iron Studios uh, logo the front side uh, where it shows marvel comics art scale want and tilux odin and a bigger picture of the statue and on the other side it says odin and island studios top it says only odin and below there are some warnings uh, and some legal details so let's jump into the review and open the case thermocall case or the protective case uh, and it has two halves the top half and the bottom half in between there is a self adhesive tape so I'll cut it with my old Allen GC knife and it is quite a smooth cut Here it is. Here you can see all the stuffs uh, placed here uh, with some pockets. So if I take the statue out, the main piece of the statue out, and I will show you. Oops, it's quite heavy. I don't know the exact weight, but it is quite heavy. So this is how it looks. Uh, the bottom says Marvel Comics Ordinary Studio Art Scale Want and Tilux. Uh, else. So this is Odin sitting in his throne with all his glory. So let's keep it in the side and see what else is in box. So this is a horn that goes into his head. Helmet rather. This is another horn. This is a horn but it goes on the side of the throne. So one piece. Oops. They are magnetic so have some affinity to attach to each other. This is 
other part of the throne. Spawn. And last but not the least, uh, Odin's trident with his right hand and gauntlet. So this is E. Uh, all the contents I have taken out. No, there is one more thing. Sorry, I forgot. A small neonia. So this will go somewhere uh, in the statue. I'll show you that. Video. So this is all about the unpacking. And I'll show you how to assemble it and how it looks after assembly. So this is the f statue uh, and let me rotate it for you how it looks from the side this is how it looks from the back some animal fur and skin on the back and side of the throne Let's put the pieces all together. So we had these two horns which will go the sides, they are magnetic so easy to assemble. Sides of the helmet. Then we have two of these which will go in the sides of the throne hmm. need to see the exact slot okay I might have used this side uh, now this is fixed so next is the trident with uh, Odin's right hand and it goes just like that. So easy to assemble that's because everything is magnetic. And finally we have the Mionia. So this will stay like this. So this is how it looks, Iron Studios Art Scale 110 Deluxe Odin. I'll again give you a 360. One thing which is very special about these statues, they are having immaculate details in the entire part of these statues. So Iron Studios, they are renowned for their detailing in this scale and they are really the market leader and this is the reason why they are the market leader because they make statues with passion and in this statue you can see the passion has been delivered so before we wrap up the video i'll show you some comparison not with other and studios but with some other statues and action figures how it looks side by side so here it is with a kotobukiya artifacts one tenth scale beast and these two are pretty good in scale uh, with each other. Here it is with the Marvel Select Thanos. Uh, we all know Thanos is bigger than uh, 
the general regular size human being though Odin is a god and as guardian and he is a little bit bigger than that of regular size people but Thanos is bigger than him so it is also quite in scale here it is with a regular size Marvel Legends Doctor Doom uh, this figure is not in scale but you can somehow display these figures all together so this is all about the video hope you like the video and like the content if you really like my video please hit a thumbs up in the video subscribe to my channel and don't forget to comment in the comment box have a great day see you soon